pictures you just saw were uh, of uh, Julian Assange's pet cat while he was uh, holed up in the Ecuadorian embassy. And uh, we're going to see more of that cat in a few moments in a really great video. But first, uh, I need to answer a question that a lot of people have been asking, which is, uh, now that Julian Assange was uh, arrested and uh, removed from the uh, Ecuadorian embassy yesterday. What happened to his cat? Well, just very briefly, uh, let me explain. Uh, that cat was uh, given to Julian Assange in May of 2016. It was given it was, uh, reportedly by his kids. And very soon afterwards, they had an online contest to name the cat. And not so surprisingly, they named him Embassy Cat. Pretty, pretty appropriate name. And uh, Embassy Cat, now remember, this is uh, 2016, was there during a very historic period, especially when WikiLeaks released the John Podesta emails, which many observers think had a very big effect on our presidential election that year, thank God. And uh, so that cat was probably in the room with Julian Assange when he hit the key to release the, uh, the those emails. In fact, uh, who knows, maybe Julian Assange had the cat, had embassy cat uh, hit the keyboard uh, himself with, uh, with his paw. You know, hey, you do the honors, embassy cat. But anyway, Let's fast forward to last year, specifically November, and by that time, for whatever reason, the Ecuadorian embassy was going back on its promise of asylum. You know, when you promise asylum to somebody, you got to keep that promise? No, they were up to trying to get out of it, trying to weasel out of it. We saw yesterday they broke it. And one of the ways they put pressure on Julian Assange is they threatened this is unbelievable. They threatened to send his cat, to embassy cat, to a pound. Now, I, I don't know how you can do that to a cat. I mean, if you don't like Julian Assange, fine, I understand that. But taking it out on his pet cat, please, guys, that's just cold-hearted. So, uh, what, what Julian Assange did in November of last year, rather than allow his cat to be... Uh, sent to a pound by the heartless uh, Ecuadorian embassy, he gave it to a friend, uh, reportedly his lawyer. So, as of what we know right now, the embassy cat is free and is being raised somewhere in, in England. We don't know where exactly, and hopefully in the near future, embassy cat will be re reunited with Julian Assange again, we hope. So um, I'm going to finish up now with, uh, you can take a look at this video, it's absolutely incredible and while you watch it, it's absolutely astounding that, that embassy staff there, the Ecuadorian embassy could be that uh, cold hearted as to threaten this cat. Uh, take a look for yourself.